It's significant to what I will be doing, what's going to happen in my life. I'm going to spend hours and hours and hours and hours in front of this computer making these exact videos. So I thought maybe you guys would want to see it. Okay guys, so welcome. Welcome back. Uh, today, you may kind of see it behind me, but I'm opening up my brand new Mac desktop. Uh, I just got it yesterday. I had a bit of a, a bit of a, I had a terrible day, and this is something that I've been wanting for a long time, so I went by the rule of treat yourself, don't cheat yourself. Uh, I got the best of the best. Now, I'm going to tell you. If you're here for any kind of tech review, any kind of actual information about this product, you're 100% in the wrong spot. <laughs> um, I don't know shit. I really went off of a lot of reviews on the internet, videos that I had watched, and the help of the Best Buy employee. Um, a guy named Maddox from Beaverton Best Buy. He's who really helped me the most. He was great, gave me lots of information. Originally I was gonna kind of start with like one of the smaller ones. Um, he talked me into the biggest, best thing they got, which means he's an excellent salesman, um, but I'm happy that he did it. I kind of go off the rule with, if you're gonna spend a massive chunk of money, spend just a little bit more to get the best of the best, um, so later you're not kicking yourself in the ass. Like, invest in yourself, and that's what this is. This is, an investment in myself, this channel. Um, I need it. <laughs> I could show you my old, I'll show you. Okay, so this is the laptop. Let me take these sticky notes that have important information on them all. This is the laptop that I had been using. It's old, it's a Windows, Windows 8. It's one of like the split twos, they have like the screen disconnects from the keyboard if you want it to. I got it, I think like four years ago or something, five years ago, maybe even six years ago. I don't know, it's old, it's awful to edit on. I need something user friendly. Like I said, not a big techie, don't know a ton about it. Love to play like video games, I love my phone, I like making these videos, but I need something that's in general fairly easy to figure out. Uh, I think that that's what this is going to offer me. I know it's going to take a while, there'll be a learning curve, being it's my first Apple product. Um, I don't know anything about their formats or how things work. I'm worried since I have an Android phone that things aren't, and I film on my phone, that maybe getting my footage onto the computer is going to be difficult. Um, but I'll learn. I, I'm pretty good at learning. <laughs> I wanted to do an unboxing of this just because I feel like that's what YouTubers do because they buy cool shit and then unbox it for everybody who didn't buy it to watch. <laughs> that's kind of a weird concept. Not to judge. Um, because I'm going to do it too. So I will come clean. I, ow, I got very excited when I got home. And I was like, ooh, yeah, look at this strip. Ripped the little strip thing off of it. And then I realized I opened up the top, this part, and I was like, you know what? I can't, um, I don't have a place to even put this. So I closed up the box, put it to the side, completely rearranged my room, got a little desk thing, had to do all of that. Now it's finally time to actually take it out of the box. You're either gonna see a sped up version or a really cut up version because I have a feeling getting this out of here is probably going to be a pain. I'm sure that there's a lot of plastics and styrofoams and shit to keep it safe. So be, be prepared for that. Here we go. Oh, I guess I could read you some of the specs off the box. Um, so I got the 27 inch iMac with Retina 5K display. The one thing that he sold me on was that this one had the fusion drive. Watching this one fire up programs compared to the the IMAX that didn't have the fusion drive was incredible. This thing definitely will be faster. And at first I was like, well that, the 27 inch, I mean, God, that's almost as big as my television that I have in my room. And it is really though, I think it's gonna come in so clutch for my editing, 
I'm not really probably gonna like seeing my face so big. Uh, especially when I'm used to it being on a phone this small. I'm like, yeah, you look great. <laughs> well, it's because you can't see shit. But, um, I guess enough rambling. I'll, I'll insert maybe a picture of all this information for people who do actually care <laughs> or know what half of this shit means. You know, the, um, there's a lot of numbers and a lot of abbreviations here. So if you're interested in that, well, if you're interested in that, you probably already actually know about it because you're watching this video. So Max or something that interests you. Uh, I need to quit talking. Okay. So we'll just open her up. I'm so excited. Also, I've been talking with my friend Brittany, who I met from YouTube. I met her, um, I met her on Twitter. She's awesome, Brittany Lyons. I think you guys will probably already seen a video where I just, maybe that'll be in my wedding video, so maybe not, but I'll do it again. She's amazing. Her name's Britt Lyons. She's on YouTube, Twitter, Instagram. She takes some beautiful pictures on Instagram. Um, you should check her out, but I was talking to her earlier about this and how I need to name it <laughs> because like I name everything, my car, my, you know, you, your big things like that you always name. We, we were kind of discussing some names. I love the idea of having like a vintage name with something that's like very new. I think that that contrast is kind of cute. So there was the idea of Margot thrown out there, but she came up with Mabel and I love it. I said, the second that I get this out of the box, I will be able to decide when I look her in the eye, I will know her name. Uh, but my heart's pretty much set on Mabel because I think that's so cute. And if you think that naming your inanimate objects is ridiculous, okay, fine. I do too. Doesn't mean I don't do it. Okay. Yep. As expected, lots of styrofoam. Give me a minute. My dog's back there in the box just... Really? Did I get you? I'm sorry. Okay, there I am. All right, there she is. That's it. Beautiful. Uh, let's see what's what's in here. Oh, I love the mouse too. He was showing me that the mouse. I mean, it does it does actually click, um, but that it's a touchpad too. So that's gonna be really cool for editing. Yeah, here's a little baby. I mean, maybe you guys aren't as impressed with this as I am, but maybe all of you guys have had Apple products forever and you're like, yeah, duh, they're the shit. Uh, I'm new, I'm new to this. I didn't know this. I didn't know how cool this was. I'm gonna set this up like right below where the computer is or where the camera is, is where my computer will be. I have it right there. Here's my bed. I'm just gonna sit on my bed, wirelessly do all of my work. This is awesome. Hmm, what do we think this is? Oh, it's like when you get phones. I spent so long cleaning my room and getting it all nice and I'm just throwing the trash everywhere. Okay, so this looks like a cloth to clean it. Damn, this is nice. <laughs> when she's more impressed with the cloth than the computer itself. Okay, so yep, a cloth to clean it all off, which is good because I bet I'm gonna get fingerprints galore on this. Holy sh... These are my first ever Apple stickers. Man, middle school me is like really jealous. And an iPhone charging cord? Oh, I guess this probably charges the keyboard and the mouse. Okay, good, good. Oh, they hid the cord from me. I'm like, okay, yeah, but how do you power it up? And the cord. Well guys, that that's it for unboxing this thing. That was generally probably really boring for you guys, but like a significant event in my life, which is why I wanted to put this out there. Um, this computer, like I said, this is an investment for my channel, um, for me, <laughs> for my future in general. I just, it's significant to what I will be doing, what's going to happen in my life. I'm going to spend hours and hours and hours and hours in front of this computer making these exact videos. 
so I thought maybe you guys would want to see it. Um, that's that's what this is. I think this is this is just my life, and this is a very exciting event. Uh, so I'll end in the little clip of when it's all set up and how excited I am about my new desk. See you then. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, it's all set up. I am. I am thrilled. Uh, I'm so excited. I need to quit looking at myself because I want to make sure that I don't look terrible. But I am so excited. Look at it. I mean, come on. How freaking cute is that? Look at my cute little desk. I got this at Ross, this little desk. Uh, earlier today, I, I vlogged a little bit about it, but it's so cute and it matches like the handle. The, just everything in my room is kind of that same blue color. Oh, this is so exciting! Uh, we're gonna power it up for the very first time, though. I like that you could just kind of see me in the screen. Okay. I think... I think it's back here. Let's see what happens. Oh. Oh! <laughs> She's alive! Fuck, that's gonna be so annoying for you guys. <laughs> I'm so sorry. So, like I was saying, once this thing gets all fired up, Oh, it's gonna give me a tutorial. Thank God, because I have no clue what I'm doing. Uh, I need to pay attention to this, so I'll uh, I'll keep you posted on how this goes. Hopefully, I hopefully I can figure it out. And... Okay, so I'm struggling. Um, I'm trying to get this this new computer set up, and I know that you guys, this isn't like riveting content or anything very interesting, but it's what is real in my life. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's, this is what I'm going through. And I, I hate that I'm always saying that now in videos, but like, I feel, and I shouldn't have to justify myself for what I want to put on my YouTube. Like, that's the whole point. It's you tube. It's what you want to put out there. I can't speak because I continuously am going on side tangents. This isn't as easy as I was hoping it was going to be. I, when I first fired it up and was doing the tutorial, it told me that I, I could use this program, this migration program that would help me get all of my stuff from my laptop back here to my Mac. And I was like, oh my gosh, that's so simple and easy. It said it needed to be for a Windows XP or newer that, and mine is, it should work. I double checked online that yes Windows 8 came after XP or so Google says I guess it's not always right but it, it won't connect it won't so I can't transfer my videos I have this external hard drive I have it plugged in right now but this is when I decided maybe I should bust out my camera because it's telling me and I was kind of expecting this it's telling me that in order to use it on this computer, I actually need to completely erase it first. And what I did was I took all of the photos, cause like every photo that I've taken over the past three or four years since I've had this phone uh, is on this external hard drive. As well as every video, every clip, every everything is on there. So there's not enough space on my laptop for all of the video and pictures. Um, luckily all of any raw footage on this hard drive has already been made into a video. I kind of knew that this was coming so I've saved all the videos on my phone. But now I have to erase everything and it's gonna erase. It's fine. The photos are fine. They're here. I'll figure out a way to get them here eventually. The videos though, I will lose all of my raw footage from my first five videos which sucks. I'm just having a hard time deciding if that's worth it. I mean, they've already been made into the final, final product, but like I cut a lot out and the only ones that I really, really want is like the footage maybe from the trip to watch my brother graduate because that was like a family thing that was significant. I mean, I don't care if I lose footage of me talking in my car. That's not important. I think I'm going to look through a couple of different outlets maybe. Uh, I was talking to Britt again and she had some good ideas about ways that I could back them up. 
uh, without using storage on my computer, so I, I might do that. But I'm getting there. I just want to get to the point where I can have footage from these newest videos that I've made on here so I could try out Final Cut Pro because all of you other YouTubers have literally made it seem like the greatest thing in the world and I'm excited to use it. Oh, and here's another thing. This mouse, like while it looks cool and I'm sure I'll get used to it eventually, geez Louise, what a learning curve on that. And this little keyboard, it's so adorable but so... It feels so tiny. Um, this was my old mouse. I love owls and I loved this mouse. Oh, guys. For someone that doesn't know anything about anything with computers, this stinks. I don't know. I'm gonna try to figure it out though. Maybe I'll keep giving you guys updates, maybe I won't, and I'll pretend just like everybody else on the internet that it was all golden and it went so great. Uh, I'm just kidding, I won't do that to you because that's not, that's not me. I almost said that's not my brand. I don't really have a brand. My brand this week has been a mess. I actually think I tweeted about it that my, um, my brand this week has been Sister Snapped <laughs> because, which I 100% stole from uh, James Charles. I was talking to another one of my friends, ZZ on there, which her channel's awesome too. I'll link hers and Brits below. Um, but I was talking to her and she was like, sister snapped. I, I like that for you. And I was like, yeah, I, uh, I'm going through it right now. You know, you are when you're doing retail therapy of this extent and chopping your hair and all this stuff. So maybe that is my brand. Uh, all right. Well, wish me luck. We'll see if I can get this figured out. Thank you guys for watching. Um, sorry this is ridiculous and boring, but it's the birth of a new child.